Okay, let's continue. Once you have created your blog, I want you to go and create a new presentation using PowerPoint. I recommend to do this. Give it a blank, blank, and I don't know, maybe you can have about three or four slides. Yes, okay. I'm gonna go and press Control M to add as many slides as I hit Control M. Let's say five slides. Then I go to the first slide, and then I can give it a title. I can, I don't know, insert something relevant to my my first activity. And then I go to the second slide, and then let's pretend that I have already here the activities to do. Yes, then to make this fast, I'm going to type only here, the numbers, and I'm going to go to the next, next slide and insert a new image. Um, let's make it a little bigger. If you, if you see these lines, they help you place the pictures and text exactly in the middle. This need, whatever you do have on the slide need, needs to be uh, visually attractive. How can I get these lines? You right click, and you go and check this part. See, look at this. If I click on it, I don't have it. I don't have that, the guides. So. I need to right click and I need to select this part. Okay? So they are exactly in the middle. You can see it is here. Okay, and another one. Slide forward. Oops, taking too long. And let me, I don't know. Insert another image and finally thank my students for being here. I'm going to put it in the middle. I'm going to select Spanish, I mean English. Then I put it exactly in the middle and have a little bit bigger font. Then I put it here. You can personalize it. Any design you choose, any template. I'm going to choose this one. Okay, let's see. And then, as I told you, this is a, it's going to be a narrator presentation. Oops. It's taking too long. Okay. To do a narrator presentation, you need to go and click on animations. I don't know why it's taking too long. Sorry, I was wrong. It's presentation with slides and you click on here, record narration or narrate 
Yes, you should have this. You may uh, test the microphone. If you see, for example, this, try to adjust it. Okay. You accept it, and then you accept here because you're going to start describing what you have on every screen. Okay, guys, welcome. This is the first activity in this course one. I want you to uh, listen carefully on what you have to do. Then you click on next. These are the activities you have to do. First, you have to uh, follow instructions. Number two, you have to design an activity. Number three, you have to give chance, blah, 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 blah. Then you go into the next one. Okay, guys, as you can see, this is a photograph of students doing collaborative work. They must go to uh, a place they reach, they need to, they must reach a, a specific point. So they need to work together. Okay, let's continue. Then once you, once you have finished, I want you to uh, send a message to me that you already did the activity, blah, 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 etc. And finally, the last one, thank you guys for being here, etc. And when we finish the presentation, and please make sure that you save this narration. You should have this. You double click here, yes, and you're going to see speakers on every slide. I'm going to put it on presentation mode to test this presentation. So please listen. Okay, guys, welcome. This is the first activity in this course one. I want you to uh, listen carefully on what you have to do. Then you click on next. These are the activities you have to do. First, you have to uh, follow instructions. Number two, you have to design an activity. Number three, you have to give chance, blah, 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 blah. Then you go into the next one. Okay, guys, as you can see, this is a photograph of students doing collaborative work. They must go to uh, a place they reach, they need to, they must reach a, a specific point. So they need to work together. Okay, let's continue. Then once you once you have finished, I want you to uh, send a message to me that you already did the activity, blah blah blah, etc. And finally, thank you guys for being here, etc. And when we finish the presentation. This is the second part of your tutorial. You have to, sorry, this is the second part of your tutorial. I'm going to stop here.